generation of renewable energy sources such as geothermal, wind and solar, with investments in biogas also increasing. Kenya has the capacity to generate 10,000 megawatts from geothermal, but as of June this year, power producer KenGen, which generates about 73% of the installed capacity, had tapped 509 megawatts of geothermal power, 820 megawatts of hydropower, 256 megawatts of thermal power, and 26 megawatts from wind power. Despite the potential for hydropower, critical information has been the missing link for investors. And we realize that uh, when developers come, private people come, we are not able to give them uh, information at one instance. And uh, we took upon it the Ministry of Energy to provide a resource assessment to private investors. And that's why we decided to do the same for small hydropower. A small hydro resources atlas has now been unveiled showing which rivers and streams have potential for power generation. The map indicates that the Kenyan highlands hold tremendous potential as rivers and streams cascade down slopes and constitute the major drainage basins which are the country's reservoir. A proposal which totaled to 170 megawatts from small hydro and that was done even before the atlas came on board. So with the atlas now we believe we are going to see an increase in this number and also in the capacity. We expect that the share of energy from, from small hydro is going to rise because many private sector people, especially those who are from outside the country, will be able to make a decision because now they know what potential is there. So we look forward to having more generation coming from a greener source, reducing our dependence on thermal generation, which is good for the country. Of the 407,820 km stretch of rivers and streams, the country has the capacity to generate 7,812.7 megawatts of hydropower. So far we have mapped uh, wind and solar and now we have done uh, small hydro. We started with uh, cogeneration but we only did uh, the sugar factories in western Kenya. We want to continue on to other biomass energy solutions. But you can confidently say that the country now we have an atlas for solar, for wind, and for small hydro. Tana River, Embu, Tharakanithi are the counties with the largest potential for hydroelectricity generation. Ronald Willy, Business Insight.